All right, guys, we're back to playing the Evil Within, and this is probably going to be my last Evil Within uh, Let's Play, because uh, people don't seem to care about it as much as some of the other stuff. Um, for all the complaining you guys do about Assassin's Creed sucking, the most popular um, Let's Plays I've done so far have been the uh, Assassin's Creed things. So, um, yeah, don't know what to say about that. Um, now we're in a, a puzzle thing in a catacombs in chapter 7. Yeah, chapter 7. Um, and uh, I've been reading today before I got on and started playing about uh, the, the reviews on the Order 1886. And uh, it, so far the reviews have looked like this to me. A bunch of gas! And I'm not, I haven't played, I've, I've demoed the, the order. I haven't, um, uh, played it fully. So I can't speak to the game and I'm not going to make comments based on a review. What I'm reacting to is how the reviews are written and what the reviews choose to focus on. And one of the complaints I've been seeing, two of the complaints I've been seeing, are that the oh guys guys just hanging out ha huh, bad pun um huh yes I saw that oh hey sup dude oh what are you you have two heads can I shoot both heads can I shoot you in the brain okay someone told me to try kneecapping so I'm trying kneecapping. And this is why you don't kneecap in this game. It's a waste of freaking ammo. That's how you do it. Just shoot it in the head. You shoot it in the head. And then it is dead. And I admit, that's kind of a lame thing about... Um, yeah, take that. Um, hello? Who's still making noise? Maybe it's you? No, you're dead. Um... That's one thing that kind of bugs me about shooter games is this aim for the head thing. That's why I absolutely adore Dead Space, because it weaned you off that. But, um, yeah, in Ammo Hoarders... Hello? Oh, hi! Are you going to sell me something? This is what... Whoa! He had too much to drink. You see that clipping in the environments? The way he's going through the wall? In 2015... Really? I mean, this came out... Ow! Okay, can I shoot you through the bars? Is this gonna be equal? Yep. Wow. Alright. You do have to shoot him twice in the head. That... See? That's a good combination of, of mechanics and design. I'm good with that. He has two heads, so he takes two headshots. That makes sense. Why can't I lift this? Does this have to be broken? All right. Because Stefan never does anything simply. Is that his name? I always forget this guy's name because it doesn't matter. He's cardboard detective. And hello? Okay. They want to keep the heating bills down. That's why they always close the doors. Um, but, uh, oh, yeah kicking the doors down. Um, that freaked me out because he was just standing there. But uh, yeah, so I was saying about game reviews. Two of the things I've seen um, complaining, like, like bashing the Order 1886 is that it's full of quick time events and it's too short. And this is when I start becoming a very grumpy... Oh, hey! Hello! <laughs> Alright, spikes! Good thing I wasn't standing there. Hit you in the head with the bottle. Whoa, hey! Wee! That's one! The twofer. Hey! Oh, you got you dropped green gel. Oh, look, he's reaching for me like Joseph. Um, dead. Sometimes it's just fun to light them on fire. It gives you a greater sense of satisfaction. Um, but yeah, the um, oh, there's a bomb there. Um, 
the thing about quick time events and short game low score is for me that is a question of personal preference not necessarily the mark of a bad game some people like quick time events and I don't think you can put a judgment call on a type of gameplay because that's the equivalent of the character can't jump marks off well sometimes um what are you why are you moving why can't I open you you're a safe um huh that was interesting um but um hello is this something I'm gonna not want to do? Gears always make me scary in this game. Um, the um, the thing about just it's a quick time event. It sucks. Well, quick time events are an established. What what's going on? Hello, hello. Oh, that was kind of eternal darkness right there. Uh, you were a dude. Safe head. Oh, well. Ah, oh, toxic gas. Toxic gas. It's like being at a convention. The air is not breathable. And I can only spend too m so much time in it. But I can't turn off the the confunk like this. Alright. This is different. Oh, hey! Ah. Ah. Chompy. Screw you, Mr. Grabby Hands. Okay. We're gonna make short work of you. Oh, you don't fall down. This is not ideal weapon to use on you. Oh. Gotcha. Um, these guys are very flammable. I wonder what they eat. Um, but yeah, so... Like, some people may not like this pushy, pushy, mashy button thing. I personally hate button mashing things like that. Okay. No more confunk. Cool. Do I have any healies? No. All right, I'm going to have to be careful. Um, but uh, I'm not going to grade the game down because there's button mash prompts. I mean, I don't like button mash prompts because they hurt my hands. Um, but that's not the mark of a bad game. I mean, I love the God of War games, even though it makes me do that to open every single chest. Um, but... You know, some people are extremely subjective reviewers and like, I don't like it, so it's a bad game. I don't work that way. And I, I really wonder how anybody can review games in that manner and call themselves a consumer advocate. Um, I prefer to avoid games. I think there's a very low chance I'm going to like going in. I want to review things that I at least have... A, a lack of disinterest in, if that makes any sense. You know, I'm not going to review Grand Theft Auto. I don't like those games. And it's, it's not just the the narrative content. I, I don't like ragdoll, goofy, shooty, shooty, open world games as a rule. Um, which is funny because I love Saints Row. Um, whoa, hey. Hey, hey. Fuck off. Oh, come on. What have I got? No. Rifle? No. Crossbow? Ah, it didn't work the way I wanted. But... Oh, shit. Alright. I like these odds better. Wow. And people say I'm ugly. Do I have any room left? Oh, I'm back to get the corner! Screw off. What am I doing? Okay, oh, one shot. Oh. Ammo hoarding in this game. I don't think I'm making it out of this one, guys. Oh, wait, rifle. Uh, uh. And use the tools available. Go me. I live to fight another round. And they drop ammo. This is excellent. I have not found it's really necessary to conserve matches so far. I hoarded them like crazy when I first started, and now I realize you don't really need to. Um, but I'm very low on ammo now. That sucked. Um, but, uh, oh shoot. Um, 
Hopefully that didn't echo. None of that recorded again. Oh, you son of a bitch. <laughs>